We're standing here today because we have had enough. It's not fair that the Port of San Diego, the city of Imperial Beach, and the city of Chula Vista are expected to comply with state and federal clean water laws, but for some reason the federal government and Veolia Water are outside those exemptions and can get away with allowing toxic waste and toxic sewage to be dumped on our communities. They are in violation of both the Clean Water Act and their permit. We are delivering a notice of intent to sue the International Boundary and Water Commission and Veolia Water North America. They are not doing their job. They are not protecting the health and safety of the United States, the residents of the United States. But if they don't act and fix the problem the next 60 days, we will take them to court to get our fair hearing to make sure that it happens. This is Chula Vista's beach as well, but it's not only Chula Vista's beach. It's a beach for all of California, and this beach should be as clean as the most pristine beach in California. Our beach is a beach for all of South San Diego County, all of California, and so we need to come together to make sure that all of our residents have access to having the best days of their lives on our beaches. The Port of San Diego is directly impacted by these sewage releases, and so we felt as an environmental steward, we had no choice but to step up to the plate and be a part of this. All the port cities, we are one family, we are one region, we work together. This right here, is what leadership looks like. Regional leadership for a regional problem. These are leaders stepping up to the plate, doing what's right, and getting something done in the face of a problem.